Jeff Dillard, and she, and welcome to a, a video log I'm going to whip up real quick here. Um, there's something I, I just wanted to quickly, uh, briefly say, but, um, yeah, I just got a whole bunch of videos, I, I got next darkest of days all pumped up, and by the time you see this, you'll have seen that they're up. Um, I got all that footage done, and I have a little bit of uh, Empire Total War footage I need to finish editing and publish, and then I can really get back in the groove. But um, uh, what happened last weekend? Uh, last weekend was absolutely spectacular, absolutely amazing. Me and Diane had a wonderful time in Penticton. Couldn't have gone better. And then uh, I came back here and started making, uh, started studying again, started making movies, and. It brings me into the next point I wanted to say that I've actually been having significant significant technical difficulties while making movies. Um, one is uh it under here here. Uh, let's wrap around my mouse. Anyway, this headset here is the headset I used to do all my my videos with. But however the audio right here doesn't work anymore. I'm not really sure what the hell happened, but the audio doesn't work anymore. The mic works fine, but uh, what happened was that basically I've been using my iPod headphones as the computer headphones and just kind of putting them in and then putting it on and talking to the mic because the mic still works pretty well. Um, in fact, I'd go to say it's flawless. However, then my iPod headphones stopped working, so then I had to buy new headphones for that and the computer. And I did that, but um, what the major problem was that my computer has about a 500 gigabyte hard drive, and that is pretty much filled up. That is uh, filled to the brim, uh, pretty much. And then I had been recording all my videos, excess videos, on, um, I don't know where it is, oh, there it is, on this thing right here, this little excess um, USB hard drive thing here. And uh, it started flaking out on me all the time. It would, midway through recording, it would just like shut down. Midway through publishing, it would just shut down. And just proved to be a colossal pain in the ass. And a frustration I did not need at the time, uh, over the past couple weeks. So I just had to like stop making videos for a little bit, just because I couldn't deal with this motherfucker here. Because he would always just take a dump in the middle of me filming. And say, yep, you know all that uh, half an hour recording you just did? Sorry, totally worthless. Ha 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 ha. And then, um, yeah, I would cut out our, the hour you spent publishing. Nope, so sorry. Kind of cut out five minutes before it's over. And um, then I cried myself to sleep at night. Not really, though. But, um, so when I went to Pendigan, actually, um, my parents, all, all my email, or not all my email, all my mail goes there, so like for some reason all my phone bills that go there and anything I've signed up for goes there. So my the money I got from the blog, if you remember the blog, the We Informant, I started up, went there and then when I came back they gave me a check, it was about $115 and um, you know, uh, with that money, since that was money basically, I was, I, I, that was pretty much like donations from you guys. So, I decided with that money, uh, I would try and put it, give it back towards the fans in some way, not like use it to go out to dinner or take Dan somewhere. I would use it to uh, give it back towards the fans. So when I did, I don't know if I can lift it up, I don't want to unplug it. I if you can barely like see it in the corner, because it's plugged in right now. I don't really want to unplug it. But anyway, uh, I went to Future Shop and bought big awesome looking one terabyte external hard drive with the money I got from the We Informant to basically hold all my videos and whatever else on it and I've been just using it today to publish movies I haven't done any filming with it but I assume um, since the publishing went absolutely smoothly with this thing uh, the filming will go smoothly as well so that is a huge huge burden for me uh, burden lifted with that so basically that allows me to have essentially uh, an infinite space to, to save all my videos now the one terabyte external hard drive 
so I have infinite space. I can, can record as much as I want, as long as I want. I'm never like um, gonna have to say, "Oh no, I gotta stop it after you know half an hour of recording." And oh no, I gotta stop and I gotta edit and I gotta publish. I can just keep going all the way through until I feel like it, and I'm not constricted by any kind of time bounds at all. And also, um, I don't have to worry about this thing crapping out during filming or publishing. So basically it's going to make the whole process of making movies a lot less frustrating for me, a lot less seamless, and a lot faster. So therefore I can get more videos out to you guys. So I'm very excited uh, to say that. Now I'm no more constraints. Well, I do have a one terabyte constraint, but um, I'm, I'm pretty comfortable that that's going to be uh, well, pretty difficult to fill up anytime soon. But who knows, if there's anyone who can do it, it's probably me, considering that I filled up my 500 gigabyte hard drive on my computer and the t external 251 that I had, so if there's, if there's anyone can, who could find a way to fill up a terabyte of memory, it's probably me. Oh, <sighs> jeez. I don't think I have anything else to say. I, I haven't had a lot of time to sit down and actually do recordings right now. I'm just editing footage I had backlogged. I'm going to start doing some new recordings soon. I'll get the next uh, Empire Total War scenario battle out. I know I need to do that. Um, get Crash Core Survival out. And um, then I, I don't know, then go back to Mass Effect, I guess, or maybe do something with the Warpath. I'm not sure. Uh, but that's kind of like my priority list right now of what I'm going to do and when. But anyway, I think that's all I've got to say to you guys. Um, thank you for watching. This has been Joseph Eastman of Stalin signing out for now, and I'm sure you'll see me next time where I'll have a lot more videos up for you guys to view in the near future.